Gallery 7 is dedicated to colour and to Jim Dine's experiments, since four rooms, or the studio, landscape painting. Using a composition process based on the combination of different elements without hierarchical distinctions. In this room, all the works focus on names, like those found in catalogues, lists, taxonomies or glossaries. The concept of glossary also serves as the reference for the group sculpture called The Wind and Tools, a glossary of terms, where three Venuses are surrounded at the waist by all the tools Dine had used since his early works. The bodies of the Venuses are multicolored, with the same range of colors that can be seen in all the other works displayed in this gallery, the reference being to the color charts used by wall painters and decorators. One of the oldest themes in Jim Dine's work, which we first encountered in Gallery 2, in Five Maroon Ropes of 1961. Color charts, he said in 1970, are for me like catalogues of jewels. On the two walls of the gallery, the heart motif multiplies in an array of engravings, coloured in either the darker or brighter hues of his different artistic periods, in the form of votive offerings, painted in countless different ways, in harmony with the natural elements or challenging skulls or skeletons like the ripe fruits or fresh flowers depicted in the Vanitas or Memento Mori still lifes of the 17th century. This array of paintings also points to the continuity with which Dine has used and indeed still uses the various forms of engravings with gravers, aquatints and etchings lithographs and woodcuts, often touched up by hand, experimenting novel processes in his studies, or cultivating strong ties over the years with many printers.